What up guys? Alpha Dog Garage here. So I picked up a set of these Brainstorm Lazy Eyes for the Mazda Miata. And I thought, well, you know, maybe I can make these better because they come with just like a halogen bulb in there. And they're pretty bright. And the cool part is they do like a the dual beam when you do high beam. So like originally on a Miata, when you hit the high beam, it changes from low to high. Well, this thing actually lets all four turn on, so it's kind of like an older style car. It's got the relay set up on the back, and it's all pre-wired. Uses the stock, the Miata plug. You actually take your headlight plug and plug it in right here. This is the one I cut off the car, um, and then that plugs in right there and then what I did is uh, I added the HID kit so you mount the ballast in the engine bay and then it already has the rod and everything all you do is um, bolt this back onto the motor and the rod is the this it's mounted in the specific spot to where they only come up the height of that and the lids actually they bolt on stock the stock screws it's a really nice kit and it's adjustable so you can actually adjust the lights it's got the blue ones for the highs which uh, those were those are newer and then let me uh, turn them on for you so let's turn on the low beam let's see. that's the high Oh, this thing came off on the wrong. Let's get this. <clears throat> there. So, super bright. I mean, the camera can't even stand it. Get, that's like pointing in the air. You can see it shining on the tree over there. <laughs> And these are the 6K, so they're kind of a white color. Super bright though. Wish these worked for an MR2, because I would definitely be putting them on my MR2 right now. But you know how that goes, you always pick up the stuff that you can't use for good deals. Super bright. And then, high beam. with the highs you can't really tell no difference but you can see them those are pretty bright they're 55 watt a piece the HIDs are actually uh, these are actually the 35 watt HID and the 55 watt halogen for the highs but you could run highs uh, HIDs in the highs too if you really wanted to just buy another HID kit and wire it in and then you have all four HID which would be a cool upgrade. I don't know, I just really like this kit because it actually, it's actually quality, like it's not China, you know? It has actual real bent metal, like, and they actually uh, powder coated it or used really good paint because it's not even rusted or nothing. And it's all adjustable. It's got the little stopper to adjust it perfect height. And you can actually bolt those lids on, you know? That's a good set, good setup. Quality. Quality kit. I looked online, these are going for like I think five fifty, six hundred bucks. And I figured, well, I don't think I'm ever gonna get a Miata, so if anybody's interested in these, I'd probably be down to sell them for a good price. They're just sitting in my garage, along with a lot of other stuff I have. I still have a set of Miata floor mats, too. So if you guys want to hit me up, I'd be happy to sell these to somebody who can appreciate them. And the relay is just a cheap little, you know, like $10 relay at uh, O'Reilly's or AutoZone or wherever you shop same little kit so you can actually change it out it's got plugs and everything 
a little diode so it only works one direction. One screw to change the bulb. This one's got four on the back and then the bulbs inside. And then it's just similar design. Just uh, two bolts pretty much. Two there, one, two. Bolts to the car, four on the lid. And then the one on the motor, which you don't actually, I grabbed that, but you could leave it on the motor and then just actually uh, pop the ball joint off and, or even pop the rod off up there. It actually, they actually use stainless steel screws on it too, so it won't rust. So there's the Miata MX-5 uh, Lazy Eye kit. If anybody's interested, hit me up. Until next time, guys. Alpha Dogs, take it easy.